It is a heavyweight collision between Ben Rothwell and Todd Duffy. well-rounded fighter in this division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup. Tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. but this fighter certainly fits the bill. Oh, 110%. He can do everything inside the octagon. Where he is most comfortable is inside of that eight-sided structure right. where most men are terrified of being. But for this gentleman, he only wants to be there. When you try to wrestle him, he's able to defend takedown. If you dare stand and strike with him, he can knock you out. He's got all the tools necessary to become a UFC champion. His first martial art, mixed martial arts, yeah. and that's not always the case. He believes that he should have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Well, at least on paper, what an even matchup. Everything between these two fighters is nearly identical. All right, now to get us started, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve LeBain. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of nine wins, three losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds, fighting out of Boca Raton, Florida, Todd Duffy! And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 39 wins, 14 losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds, fighting out of Kenosha, Wisconsin, Ben Rothwell! Okay, could take yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. You ready? You ready? All right, so the fight is underway. We will see how it plays out. It's a big one fight at the Las Vegas. It's really hard to think of a weakness that we have seen on film. From either guys in the UFC division. I feel like both of these guys are the top of the food chain. They're the best of the best that we can put inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded, they have every skill, and that is gonna be on display tonight in this key matchup. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Right hand punch for clinch. Couple of uppercuts there for good measure. And just misses with that big right hand. Rothwell's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. 
Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Stuff to take down, no problem. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. And both guys really throwing with authority. Just over three minutes now to go. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Nice leg kick. Nice straight punch. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. And they separate. Oh! Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Great punch. And a miss with the win. The win. Gets on the feet. His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Kane Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he lands that over the right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. Nice one two there. Just missing on the uppercut there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Blocks the shot. Oh! Huge right hand! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! Look at how fast. The only person I can do this to is maybe John. John, there's a, there's a weight difference. I don't know if you know you too much. You miss a lot of your classes. If I'm going to do this to anybody, it's Eddie. Just missing on the uppercut there. His opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up. But you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Round two winding down. So there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Are you ready? You ready? Second round here. Well-placed kick there. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Rothwell. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Duff. Well, gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. That shot blocked by Duffy. And he landed the right hand there. Work here defensively. Double leg takedown, no good. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave. Oh, 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 he might be in trouble here after that big diving punch. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Rothwell. Checks the leg kick. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of his 
himself into those strikes to the head. Just out of range with the big right hand. A oh, little single. Oh. Attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ndanu. And you know they still haven't found Alistair Overeem's head. He's just out of range with that right hand. Oh, what a punch. Fifteen seconds to go. Headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. That was awesome. He really hurt him there. Okay, he's in trouble. There's no way he's gonna recover. I need you to get out there and I want it. Are you ready? Ready? Third round underway. Oh! Oh! This is what tonight. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut range. Oh, he might be out. Trying to establish that jab once again. He could be in trouble. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He doesn't know if he's in the octagon or at his mama's house. Thank you. He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Knock him out. The fight's done. Back to the feet now. Oh! Big knee to the body. Duffy's got the tie clinch now. Oh, nasty cut there right on the bridge of the nose. Absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is called to stop in this contest at 1 minute, 39 seconds of round number three. Playing the winner by knockout, Tom Duffy! So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined.